So today it's all about our own cat Angel who loves all the attention. Coming up! And welcome to my cat crazy channel. I got many requests to talk a little bit about our own cats so that's what I'm gonna do and today it's about Angel. Angel is a Lynx Point Spotted Tabby Oriental Short Hair Cat and Zeus's sister. She is a real tomboy and challenges Zeus every day while also making sure she's awake when all the others are asleep so that she gets all the attention from us. Angel was born in our home in the morning of October 21st, 2012 and she was the first of Xena's one and only litter. At that time, Xena, with true tortitude, wasn't too thrilled about having babies. She'd rather hang out with my husband Victor and be spoiled. So when Angel was born, she just kicked her in the head, left her in the closet and ran to my husband who was in the middle of taking a shower. He immediately saw what was going on because the second baby was already coming and so that shower was cut short. He helped Zena with the other babies and the moment he heard this little girl cry in the closet, he put Angel into the crib right away. She does have a little scar from Zena's kick on her head here, but you would really have to look for it to find it. Ever since then, Angel has slight abandonment issues, but other than that she's just fine. Uh, she is much cuddlier than the other ones and you can hear her purse in the next room. She can't get enough of me holding her in my arms like a little baby, like, you know. She uh, likes to talk a lot too and comes up with all kinds of creative sounds to tell us thick-headed bipedals what she wants. Her favorite toys are the metal wrappings around a champagne cork or the string you pull off when you open a Stella and Chewy's bag. When she's, she sees me opening up a bottle of champagne, let me do that right here, or, or a Stella and Chewy's thing, then uh, that's, she's right there and ready to play with this as long as we are willing to do that, okay? And now let's oh, try this here. Angel, look what I am doing here. <laughs> Angel, look, look, look. Uh-oh. Oh, oh. Look, look, Angel. Look what I have here. <gasps> it's a bottle. Of course it doesn't work. <laughs> when you try to do that, it just does not work, does it? Angel, look. As opposed to Sushi, Angel is absolutely fearless. When somebody uh, is at the front door knocking or delivering a package, uh, she runs over, crawling together with Zeus, while so she is hiding behind the aquarium. Angel can even do a little bark here and there, which is like woof, woof, she does that. So originally, Angel was supposed to go to my dear friend Anne, but when we found out that her brother Zeus had a severe heart condition, we decided to keep her to stay with Zeus together with their mom, Zena, to make his life as stress-free as possible. What is Operation Acoustic Kitty? A top secret project by the CIA? A new song? A surgery to make cats talk? Or an instrument? And here's the answer to the quiz of the day. The CIA launched a top secret project to spy on the Kremlin and Soviet embassies in the 1960s called Operation Acoustic Kitty. The plan was to train cats to eavesdrop on conversations. The first feline agent had a microphone in his ear, a transmitter near his collar and an antenna in his tail. This would allow the cat to record and transmit sounds uh, from its surroundings. It is said that the project was abandoned due to the difficulty of training the cat to behave as required and the equipment was taken out of the cat and the cat then lived a long and happy life. Afterwards, the project was cancelled in 1967. Can cats see themselves in the mirror? 
Oh, that's a good question. That's the same question as asking if cats have a soul. And uh, there are some astonishing experiments. They did an experiment with uh, magpies where they put a dot in their chest feathers to, that they couldn't see it, only in the mirror. And the thesis was that if the magpie recognized itself in the mirror, it would try to remove the dot. And guess what? These clever birds actually tried it. They went even further with the experiment and tried a cleaner fish. And even this fish tried to remove the spot. He was only able to see it in the mirror. Cats, however, only seem to see another cat in the mirror because they don't want to remove any dots. So in my opinion, they are asking themselves, why should I try to remove the spot? I just don't feel like it right now. Currently, there are the coolest video on social media with cats parents using a cat face filter and getting the cat's face. In my opinion, the reaction of their cats shows that their cat not only recognizes their pet parents, but also themselves. But science sees differently so far. And if you want, want to know more about it, um, if cats have a soul, then please watch my episode number 151 and Petra will put a link in the description. And I will. And it's so funny because I, I, you know, I know they can't see themselves. I just, I just think they don't freaking care <laughs> because yes, I yes. have like our cat Soshi. You know, she's always like, like really like looking into the mirror, looking at yes. herself, and you know, like doing all these things. And I'm like, oh, you certainly do see yourself you know and she yes. loves watching herself in the mirror you know so it's really cool thank you so much sebastian okay, okay. <laughs>you and would like to see more then please subscribe to my channel and in case you haven't done that already give us a pause up and share with your friends thank you so much for your support and i hope to see you again next tuesday and don't forget cats rule and so do you